In an economic environment where most businesses are shrinking to stay afloat, Peter Sheft, owner of Colonial Lanes here, chose to expand. He transformed his family-owned bowling alley into this family entertainment center. The finishing touches are being put here on the outside of the Colonial Bowling and Family Entertainment Center on Brunswick Pike across from the Lawrence Shopping Center. But the inside is impressive. Today is the ribbon-cutting ceremony, but word is out about this place, and customers, big and small, are already spending their Friday afternoons here. Some have come in just to get a tour. Everybody likes to see you know, the inside and everything, so we turn on all the bells and whistles. We show off the lighting, the special effects, of course, uh, the big screen TVs and the, the projection screens. Um, we tend to go through the whole facility. We'll show you, um, you know, we have Glow Light Laser Tag, which actually is a brand new Laser Tag Arena, um, as well as uh, our traditional bowling lanes, uh, a cafe, an arcade, and our full-scale restaurant and bar, which I'm particularly excited about. Uh, we actually have a 35-foot bar with 12 draft beers on tap, um, everything from exotic, like Smittix Irish Ale, uh, to your classics like your Budweiser and your Pabst Blue Ribbon. Uh, our, our cuisine varies. Uh, we haven't unveiled our full menu quite yet. Currently, we're working with our cafe menu, which is a traditional bowling fare with your chicken tenders and your pizza, as well as a few twists that we've added, such as macaroni and cheese bites. Owner Peter Sheft credits small business incentives for helping him make this family dream come true. We managed to do that with the help of the Small Business Association uh, and the RBAC, which is the Regional Business Assistance Corporation. Uh, in partnership with a local bank, uh, Team Capital Bank, we were able to bring them all together at the table and help us fund this project, which wouldn't have happened without all those team members so to speak, coming together. So it's perfect synergy of the government programs that are out there that uh, made, made this happen. Without them out there to assist small businesses like us, we wouldn't have been able to open up. This new center has enabled Sheft and his family to create 60 new jobs, quite an achievement for this small business in this tough economy. Sheft hopes the risk of opening up in the midst of a recession will pay off. Reporting in Lawrenceville, Sibyl Morenci, WZBN News.